Hey, what's going on? It's Carmen Shay. I'm hanging out here at the PST Princeton Plastic Surgeon Live Lounge with Dr. Hamaway. How are you doing, Carmen? I'm doing great. So we're going to talk about Brazilian butt lifts today. All right. Well, what do you want to know about them? Everything. All right. So a Brazilian butt lift is basically a procedure. Um, it's, it's basically fat transfer from anywhere in your body to your butt to improve the shape and the size. Mm -hmm. um, it's... Uh, basically uh, a combination of liposuction and the best thing is you move the fat from where you don't want it like it could be from around your waist or your thighs or in the lo lower abdomen and we inject it back into the butt is it safer to do like to inject your own fat rather than have like an implant absolutely so implants um there's a problem with implants in the butt for for a few reasons mm -hmm. um unlike the breast okay we're always sitting on our butts yeah. okay so it tends to shift the implants around. Also, it's uh, even the, the implants themselves are a little bit harder, so they feel kind of unnatural. Yeah. And they have a lot of problems in the long run. Um, with your own fat, the best thing about it is it, it's part of you. It feels completely natural. It feels like it belongs there. Um, and it's very hard for someone to tell that you've had anything done. Is that permanent when you get it done? So most of the fat is permanent. The uh, what we do is we're, we're going to inject the fat in there and over inject it to make it a little bit larger because your body's going to absorb some of it mm -hmm. and the rest is going to remain and it's going to be just like any other fat in your body. If you gain weight, it's going to get a little bit bigger, and if you lose weight, it's going to get a little bit smaller. So like a butt like Nicki Minaj's, mm -hmm. is that a Brazilian butt lift or is it that like? Um, it could be. It could be a <laughs> uh, you know. Probably a bazillion butt lift um, if, if she had anything at all. Yeah. I, I doubt it was implants. Okay, because it's huge. Yeah. <laughs> the thing about it, though, is that you need to have enough fat to move around. Yeah. And a lot of people uh, come in and say they want a Brazilian butt lift, and you need to, you know, gain a little bit of weight. This is the this is the time to go to McDonald's and, yeah. and really uh, uh, get the fat that you need to move around. In the healing process for that, how long does that take? Um you're f gonna feel sore for a couple weeks. The hardest thing about it is that you can't sit down during that time. So if you sit on one side too much, is yeah. it would it make it uneven while it's healing? It could. Like if you do that in the first few weeks, yeah. um, you're gonna probably lose some more fat on that one side more than the other. So it's really important to keep the pressure off and try to keep the pressure on your thighs rather than directly on your butt. Okay, awesome. Well, if you want more information on Brazilian butt lifts, head over to PrincetonMD.com.